Well, welcome aboard. I'm Captain Jake, and we're back with another episode of Battlestar Galactica Deadlock with the Broken Alliance add-on. As always, this game is uh, published, uh, I'm sorry, developed by Slytherin and Black Lab Games and published by Slytherin. I'd like to welcome everybody back to the channel. If you enjoy this, uh, please uh, leave a like, leave a comment. I really like the comments. And um, if you're really so inclined, please uh, subscribe for more exciting adventures on my channel. Should have went to uh, same bat time, but the kind of uh, <laughs> gives you a little bit of my age. So we <laughs> yeah, I guess I did do it, didn't I? Okay, well, we're going to get in today. And take a look. We got to RP. I think. Yeah, what did we end up having? Did we get this battle star? That one and that one. Okay, we needed one more ship. Fill out. Except for I don't think I can because we're at 79. So we're going to be down by one. We were going to just straight jump right into here and what is this one tactical advantage that's the one that we did last time so close that one well this one is interference and we're looking at an interesting setup of ships over here shooters so close now one two three four five six so let's take a look at where this one is okay he's over there he's over there also over there way over there way over there ah well we can take this guy Ooh, 220 to jump Ooh, i don't know if we're gonna do that one let's see what we got here the nuclear tests are a public declaration by Cylon standards, and the message is simple. They have thermonuclear warheads. Colonial Fleet was days away from being dismantled by the intercolonial courts. Now, on the back of a nuclear threat, Kane has the ear of every single seat in the quorum. Vergon has provided a large quantity of nuclear material to Colonial Fleet, on the condition that no one asks why they hadn't disposed of it yet. Our orders are to escort it to the labs at Aquaria and, whether we like it or not, restart their nuclear program. This is serious, Commander. We screw this up, the Cylons have the means to wipe out the entire 12 colonies without any chance of retaliation. Okay, let's see. Cylon propaganda threatens the escalation of nuclear warfare with colonial fleet forces. Kane has secured the release of two Vergon freighters containing unrefined nuclear materials. Expect resistance at the Aquarian LZ. Yeah, no kidding. I bet it's going to be. We get uh, 1040 Tilium, 1800 requisition points, blueprints for Atlas. And I can't remember which one the Atlas is. And the Nuke blueprint. So. Like this well, that would be the one that's probably. Mm, not unlocked here because I don't think it's a battle star. Okay, so. Let's get into it, I guess. Let's go ahead and jump to here. Okay, confirm that jump. 400 we can jump over to here to keep the forum jump to here from that jump confirm and enter all right well we got three battle stars two of them are rookies and rangers and adamant okay so let's go ahead and proceed and let's see if we can take these guys out should be interesting could be a hell of a battle Okay, so let's take him, move him back. 
Uh, first off, let's see what we got here. One. One, two, three, four, five, six, three, eight. Eight to our six. And what do we have here? We got these two. We're going freighters. Okay, so. Well. Now, if I remember correctly, these guys have the firepower above. So let's see what we can do here. Okay. Proceed. Nervous with so many uh, big ships in there. Oh, we can only hope. We'll keep our nose pointed at them. Prepare to jump in three, two, one. Jump successful. Cylon Dratus contacts already present at the landing zone, Commander. Freighters one and two are both accounted for. We need to clear the blockade so the Vergon pilots can make atmospheric entry. Okay, defend Vergon nuclear freighters. Okay, great. Wow. First off, let's not have them go that way. Understood. Get over there and make sure we don't break them. Get them over here. Okay, good. Get all of these guys. Launch the squadron. Launching alert, Vipers. Get. What I want to do with these guys. Get. These two moving this way. And these two moving here and going down. And my light one, but he's got more. He can take more damage. So. We'll Okay, in turn. Escort clearance zone is active. By design, mass detonation devices require two entities to arm. Commander, has it not occurred to you that the concept of nuclear testing was manufactured solely to inspire this very reaction? Rot in hell, robot. By your command. Well, he was not being very nice. Okay, so turned. Let's get over here and get turned and get into this asteroid field. Maybe we can hide behind some stuff. On it, Commander. Turned. It's these guys. I didn't notice that. Understood. Yes. That was stupid on my part. Yes. 
guy. I'm going to have him defend. Okay. So, not sure what we got here. Let's go ahead and select the targets. Select yes, the sir. Nearest one. in the turn and see what happens. All right, I'm not seeing any. What I'm gonna do is keep these guys That's together. Clear zone is intact. Civilian ship is taking damage. Yeah, I can see that. Okay. Now we'll concentrate fire here. This one. This one. Fire munitions at him. Focus fire at him. And get you back here. Right. He needs to defend whatever. On it, Commander. Turn. Down. How many long does it take for them? Okay. Let's get these two. Fire munitions at him also. And focus fire on him. Minerva's turned towards directly towards him. Focus fire on him also. Take one out, that's important in turn. No. These guys turn more this way. On it, Commander. Okay. In turn. We're gonna hammer the frackers till they can't get back up. Missiles incoming. Okay. So their missiles missed, thank goodness. Turn. Targets about go freaking after him, okay. This guy is going away. That's the most important the most dangerous one right now. And check the ranger here. Ranger. A little bit of damage. We'll get you two turned this way a little bit. And we'll see what they fired the munitions at. Next, these guys are breaking off to here. Greater and unidentified contact. This guy just shot missiles at me. Artemis. He 
just gonna take if I do flak left side. Oh left side. Okay. You get you turned out here. That's the target. Focus fire here. And I think these guys, by the time he gets hit, will be go away. That depends on what these are. Yes, sir. So say we all. I'm going to take a bunch of hits, but we'll be okay. You two. Continue this direction. I want to keep them together. I want concentrated firepower, folks. All right, so let's try that. Okay. Civilian ship is taking damage. Missiles incoming. Hmm. They're coming in at the Daedalus. Interesting. All right. And but you. Get over there and attack that guy. Goodness. All right. He blowed up. Okay. They're engaged. He is attacking torpedoes. That's where I screwed up. Trying to determine whether these are going to be good, bad, or indifferent. So, let's look here. It's that. Raider Squadron. Guys are going after Raider Squadron, and he's going after that one. Okay, let's do this. Let's take this one, sign him as the, also sign him as green, and let's send him after like the target. Oh, need to get here. Okay. You two guys need to see focus fire on him. Get you down. On it, Commander. Yes, sir. And you can decide. Hmm. 
You can focus fire on. You focus fire on him first. Yes. And you two are out. Yes, sir. I want you to focus fire on him. I think I can get you quickly turned. All right, move those guys as far as I can go. Okay, and you gotta guess that's gonna be good in my turn. IFF confirms unit is hostile. I've got four or five lower six. Targeting. Fuck! A wing! Minerva is taking damage. Hmm. Minerva? Ah. Really? That's shocking. Guys, turned. Taking a lot of damage. This guy. This Minerva. Turning. Cancel yeah. targets. Focus flyer on him. Yes. You guys, you're going there. You guys are going after. Not the Raider Squadron. All right. You four. Like the target. And it's Squadron target is confirmed. This Minerva is turning and going up. Yes, sir. He should turn because he's left sided. Beat the crap. Yes, sir. And he is going to. Missiles yes. on their way. Uh, what do we have here? That's the target. Focus fire here. Derva. Gets targets. Focus fire on him. This Minerva. Yes. And gets targets. Focus fire here. Check. Yep. Missile tubes prepped. Let's look here at Oops, this Minerva is firing is up. Okay, we're gonna have to do this. Why they may run into each other? Focus fire on him, please. Let's see this ranger ready to fire again. Okay, all of the rangers. Fire munitions at him. You did him? No. Alright, well, we're going to focus fire. Cancel targets. 
focus fire here. The sky is down to 34 with more coming in. That should be good. Now it's Artemis. Left side is beat up. But they're all focusing fire there. That's Minerva. He's focusing fire and shooting his missiles. And this guy is defending still. Okay, that should be good. Let's see what happens. These guys firing. Um uh, pretty good, okay. And Minerva is taking damage. Artemis is taking damage. Can't keep them out. Missiles incoming. We're taking sustained fire. Oh, damn, that's not good. These guys now. So say we all. Focusing fire here. These guys are still after the Raider Squadron, which is down to 22. These guys select the targets. Him. Yes. Now, Adamant. Uh, X. Whoa, look at that here okay ranger part of this but left side is here nerva front This Minerva is up and front. Engineering is in trouble. Hey, okay. these are battle stars, so let's get over to here. Okay, that's good. Mm, all right. These guys are going after that Raider Squadron. This guy is Raider Squadron. Now they have a lot of crap here, but that's, and I don't know what this is, but we shall find out here momentarily in turn. Artemis is taking damage. Minerva is taking damage. Ranger is taking damage. That's the rain. Yeah. Okay. Now we can see what that is. And he is now focusing fire on him. Check. This guy is still there. Let's see. This Ranger's left side is bad, so. So here. say we all. And this one is his left side is also not doing good. But we're going to put all of our missiles on him. Missions, yes. And did the Raider Squadron disappear finally? Let's see here. Okay, good. They're attacking him. Fronts have yeah, no damage. No damage. Blew him up. That's good. Yes, Commander. 
On it, Commander. You two. Focus fire, not on him. Die in front of me. Okay. I yes, Commander. Say it. Focus fire on him also. I can get rid of this guy. That'd be good. Tough battle. Alright. I may lose something, but. Minerva is taking damage. Missiles incoming! Artemis is taking damage. Fire at will. Damn it, lost the Minerva. Good. Took him out. That was important. Okay, you guys. Select the targets. Him. Yes, sir. You guys. Our munitions. Nope, we're really gonna focus fire on him. You. So say we all. Focusing fire there. Okay. Let's do all of these fire munitions at him. Yes, targets. Focus fire on him. Now, Artemis may lose him. What do I have? Oh, top is good. Bottom is good. And then this Minerva, his front is badly damaged. But, okay, we're primarily attempting to kill what we can here so let's go ahead and artemis is taking damage minerva move. is taking damage friendly unit is down yeah okay okay you need to focus fire there he is not down yet Fire munitions at him. And all of you guys should be attacking him. We're going to lose a lot of ships, but hey, we can complete the mission. That's what's important. All right, he's got nothing, no damage. I'm turning. Front. So say we all. Let's see what happens here. Minerva's taking damage. down so say we all flop but not a whole lot front and rear because of those missiles yes sir all right So say we all. Okay, let's see what happened. In turn. Minerva's taking damage. Minerva down. Yeah. Lost all three battle stars.
think I took out both. Yeah, he just hadn't blown up yet. In turn. Sweep the deck to prepare for catch. We're done here. Ah, that right, really buddy. destroys That's the right. hell out of my fleet, doesn't it? But. All right. Let those guys do that. I'm going to pull back. Yes, sir. Yes, Commander. All right. Hammer him so he should go away easily in turn. Like I said, that should be it. Dranus is clean. Freighters one and two are clear to begin descent. There is something you should understand, Commander. At every juncture, the Cylon people remain at the whim of human endeavor. You build your ships and your guns, and we respond in kind. Now you insist on nuclear weaponry. After today, so shall we. It sounds scared. I am Clothos, and we should all be scared of what stirs, shipbuilder. Comms channel is dead. Commander, I don't know who or what that was. We have to tell Kane about this, don't we? Not my place to tell you people how to do your jobs, but she will find out. One way or the other. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Well, I lost three battle stars. One of them was an expert, but we completed the mission point, so let's view the replay. Escort clearance zone is active. Escort clear zone is intact. Priority one is in safe hands. We're gonna hammer the frackers until they can't get back up. Switching gun to manual. Break, break, break! Target acquisition is screwed. Give me manual controls now. I'm inbound on your starboard. Seven high tens. I've got four, five, lower six. Targeting. Fuck! Ah, I winged! They're already in our network. I can't keep them out. We're taking sustained fire! Incoming! Nothing but the rain. Firing solution is online. That's secondary battery. Full attack mode. Fire at will. Keep your target locked and watch for clearance. They're giving us a hell of a storm, sir. Optimizing firing solutions. Sweep the decks and prepare for catch. We're done here. That's right, frackers. That's right. Well, I sure was bloody. We lost three battle stars, but we got through it. So I guess that's what's important. So let's go ahead and proceed. Not sure what's going to happen next. I got to get um, 
my secondary. Oh, unlock the blueprints, Atlas and the nukes. Okay. Let's go to blueprints first off. Oh, it's the Atlas carrier. Okay. Uh, broadside is heavy turrets. Oh, and a squadron repair. Pitch control, squadron evades. Atlas is an iconic remnant of our guns and privilege history. Slow and densely armored, the Atlas carrier can now provide fighter support for modern colonial groups. Okay. And missions. Wow. That costs a lot of RP, man. Before we do that, let's see here. Good, good, good. This one. They're back in. 140. No. I need to build the ship. As much as I like this one. Mm, let's see. Make and mark shift design moving the ability and defensive to raw firepower. Smaller than Jupiter and less armored than the Artemis. Aggressive turret placements in every sector has given them an every reputation of effect. Yeah, well. Okay, we, want, we can't rush it, but we can build it. Four turns. Billium is down now. Done. And these guys. Resource points. No. What the hell is this? Effective against armor plating, low hull damage. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, during FTL insertion. Alright, well, we need to have at least one always fitted with the nuke. And it's not going to move him. Can I move him? Okay. And jump him to jump him all the way to here. And jump him to here, though. From the jump. This guy, 140, jump, do here, confirm the jump. Okay, let's see what this one is. Broken Alliance 7, 6, 65, 293. A deep fissure in the Jory mining colony is destabilizing the whole station. Although it's shown no signs of trouble before, the stress fractures are escalating quickly. Kane has given us the green light to use Daedalus as a first response unit. We have over 60,000 people to move, and an unknown amount of time to do it in. This is absurd. Surely Lucinda does not mean for you to endanger Daedalus at Ground Zero. It's a disaster in progress. We can't risk waiting for the colonies to mobilize their fleets. Anyway, that would just be a logistical nightmare. Kane has already greenlit the operation, so get on board or get out of the way. 
Well, good. We had a lot of tellium, a lot of requisition points. Let's see the Drury Mining Colony at uh, oh, Brian holds 65,293 known workers, security, and family members, life support vessels can only account for 6,300 evacuees. Emergency response fleets from Scorpion and Libra are standing by as secondary units once Dennis has accomplished the first response to the evacuation. LZ coordinates have been prepared and distributed to the fleet. It requires a present day list and mission mark. Okay. That's fine. Can't jump there straight there anyway, so we're going to end our turn. Detected a base star group, sir. All right, so now what we need to do is we have here, we have two shooters and a frigate. And Task Force Adama, we have two gunships, some frigates, the corvettes. So let's transfer the gunships from... Uh, Bones Endless now has five ships. Building one, we can put another one there. So let's go ahead and transfer what here, another gunship, another frigate. Yes, transfer gives us more vipers is what we need. So let's go ahead and close. So let's see, jump to 20. We could jump to here, but we can also wait. Close. These don't go away. So go ahead and end our turn, see what happens. Base star group has been detected. Okay, there are both groups that you don't need. Oh, what does it say? Two turns yet. Uh, Blueprints, did I get the blueprints for that? Let's don't believe so. Still locked. And we don't have enough. We'll get done here. That's it. Our turn. Let's see. We have a new mission, Commander. Okay. What is this one? Research. This Aquarian research station has been under Cylon surveillance for a while now. Despite that. The scientists have been working out here for years, and are refusing to leave. Clear out the Cylon spies before they change their mind and decide to blow it all up. Okay, protect the science state. Civilian teams are still present in the station. Ambush the Cylon presence to protect the researchers. Well, well that's all good and well and, and all that kind of happy-go-lucky crap, but... I don't know what the hell is going to be there. I need enough telling for emergency jump. So let's go ahead, close, let's end turn. One of our allies is being attacked. Okay, that's fine. It's not going to reduce the quorum. You get transferred to here. Um, and Take a look at the ships. I don't got anything I can build for that amount. Hmm, we can we can build that. Let's build. Done. And in turn. Fleet group has its coordinates. Yeah. 
Let's go. I'm going to build that unit. The Quorum of Twelve has disbanded, sir. Your orders? Oh, really? One, two, three, four, five. I don't know why they're out. I understand that they're still in. Ah, huh. very interesting. Uh, go ahead and close. And he's going to go here and drop that guy out. Who do we have here? I see all these guys are over here. What do we have here as far as size fleet do we have there? Oh, small. Okay. Well, that's small. This guy. Jump. Here. Confirm the jump. And if we're larger than they are, we should be able to handle them, so make sure it's not twenty thousand. Alright, enter. Base star group has been detected. Escort group is under attack. Yeah. Alright, we will run a quick this quick mission. And what the hell? Seed. And we'll see what happens. Oh, at least we get two battles in this one, even though that was a big one. We can get some experience here, I think. Yeah. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. All right. It, uh, oh, we have no vipers in that group. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, that's cool. She turned out then. On it, Commander. Coming back here. All right. Okay. In turn. Four, basically, one, four and four. Stations, second mission one throughout the ship. Right. Action stations, action stations. This is not a drill. Yeah. One carrier launch. Come on, I'll let you. Let you come on all day long. Prepare for engagement. Okay. Focus fire right here. I haven't seen anybody shoot yet. That's always good. In turn. Shoot to clear. Preparing payload. Fire control is warmed up and preparing solution. Okay, we'll take those out. Yeah, 
boat. Yes, sir. Okay, not quite in target range yet. Understood. Have much heavier firepower forward, but we'll let them. And prototype squadron in turn. Target acquisition is screwed. Give me manual controls now. Should just about be dead. Okay. Hollow three. Okay. Not sure who is maneuvering to where, but we'll just leave it there in turn. Okay, here comes some missiles. Out of both of them. Okay, go here. Here's that they are shot at him. Yes, sir. And you three will go to here. Yes, Commander. We will focus fire on him. Okay, in turn. Target is four, five, five. Missiles five. incoming! Hostile unit oh, identified. Oh my goodness, they just tracked him perfectly, didn't they? Okay. So, you two. You back up. Uh, you two. Fire munitions. Turn. On it, Commander. Uh, you turn also. On it, Commander. All right. In turn. Celestra is taking damage. Solution updated. Target acquisition maintained. Fire solution is online. All right, everyone is going to. Oh, that's not everyone now, is it? It's a mm, second. All right, focus fire on him. Yes, please. And yes, I know at least one can't do it. How bad is this for her? Uh, Until they can't get back up. That's what I thought it would be.
And we know what that one is because that was the one that launched the Vipers. Or I'm sorry, the Raiders. Focus fire. And into. Optimizing firing solutions. Yeah, that's okay. You take it. Missiles incoming! Understood. All right, let's see here. We go over here. Yes, sir. Enter. We're taking fire. Not hitting it nearly as hard as I thought they would. So say we all. Okay. In the turn. Okay. Knew that was going to last. But these guys. About. What do we have here? This right side, not a big deal. Understood. Boom and rock and roll, baby. All right. So say we all. Let's so see if he actually shooting. Something that we actually shoot. All right, enter. They're breaking. Push the line. If we haven't used up the whole armory, it's a good day. He didn't last long. All right. Well. Okay. Let's see. Ranger got more experience. We did too. We finally got some experience. Lestra. Only so goes up to 40 and the mana core. Okay. Well, we'll review the replay. Set condition one throughout the ship. Action stations, set condition one throughout the ship. Action stations, action stations, this is not a drill. Weapons free, prepare for engagement. Tubes are clear, preparing payloads. Fire control is warmed up and preparing solutions. Give me manual controls now! Target is four, five, by nine, nine. Solution 
updated. Target acquisition maintained. Fire solution is online. We're gonna hammer the frackers till they can't get back up. Optimizing firing solution. We're taking fire! Breaking, push the line. If we haven't used up the whole armory, it's a good day. All right, let's proceed. We'll uh, call that an episode, though. Finish up with that battle. And let's see here. Got this guy is back. Oh, what do we got? Oh, yeah. This ship is built. So let's transfer you to Oh, we can't transfer. Let's go to the close. What do I have here? Do I have a ball full of sevens? Frigates, 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 gunship. Shooters and a battle star. Okay, let's close. This guy. Well, what do we have here? Okay, he's four, he's 68. Yeah. No thanks. All right, so let's see. You need to get him back in. Him back in. They're all not going to happen. Okay, we can get him back in. Pick him. Jump to here. This one. Do anything there. Jump and B. Jump to here. You. No. You can jump the many ships. here confirm the jump and end our turn fleet group is ready to jump okay and that will be it next time we come back we're going to have to build up more tillium so we can get this guy to jump over here so we can get the quorum back in session here 
Africa's good. All right, jump to here. Jump to this guy sitting right here. Well, it's on a wall. Maybe needs another turn. But anyway, we will leave that for next time. So let's go ahead and hit save. Probably the most boring part. Let's see. October. There we go. We'll hit save. Burn. Load. Perfect. Cancel. Exit to main menu. All right. Well, we got two battles done. Hopefully, you've enjoyed today's episode. I enjoyed bringing it to you as always. And we'll be back real soon with another another episode. So, as always, I'm Captain Jake. Wishing you fair winds and following seas. Until next time.